Welcome back to Let's Play Fauna Sphere. They've opened up a new area, the Inlet Isle. So we're going to go check that out. I know that this goal is for a voucher exchange and we will need amber, 30 amber. So we're going to take a little run through all the places that we could get amber and hope we've gathered up enough by the time we get there to do the goal. So we're going to head to the rock garden and then straight up to the avalanche. The avalanche is one of the first places that you find that you can get amber and was one of our earliest goals. We needed 10 amber when we got here. Well, we've accomplished that one. So let's run across without getting sidetracked by too many vileys. Let's play! All right, so he's got to sap some vileys. Of course, he's well on his way to level 14 and probably thinks a little extra vile fighting and a few blocks of pollution will help on that goal. That's just his personal goal. Well, none of the trees are producing... Oh, there's one. Let's get that tree. We'll grab an amber. So the avalanche is the first place. Now we'll go through the gate to the frozen village. And if we head straight across the frozen village, we'll find the whalebone isthmus. And that's another place we can get amber. So we zoom clear across to the other side. <laughs> Okay, I can see that Let's Play is going to have to zap pollution on the way. And we're going to let him, because he likes to play. When you find the same kind of pollution stacked together like that, you get extra bonus points on your egg points. So here's the whalebone isthmus. Let's jump in. And here we have another tree. Get it quick. You know, let's play, if you spend all your time shooting these filies, your energy level and your happiness meter are going to go down. You might not get all the way through showing us how to do this goal. You do realize that, don't you? Well, evidently he doesn't care. But here's another amber. Then we're going to get up. Oh, yay! This one had quite a few trees. Gonna go up and go to the Meyer Knoll. Once again, we have to tear across to the other side of the Meyer Knoll because that's where the next gate's going to be the one to the gorgeous meander. Run! Run, let's play! There we go. Gorgeous Meander. Now, the Gorgeous Meander is quite extensive. There's a tree right here that we can grab. Although the Vileys are getting tougher and tougher. So let's see how Let's Play does with the Vile Nine-Eyed Gassy. When we came across this the first time, to be able to have the Searing Mesa on our world gate, we ended up having a friend help us. But Let's Play thinks he's stronger now and can take this Vileon on by himself. 
But if you notice, his happy meter is going down. Come on. Come on, let's... Yay! Good job. And we'll just dig a root to kind of bring that happiness up a little more. Fifteen happy points every time. So, there's a density tree here that's giving out amber. This log usually has two. Woo! Lucky us! That usually has two violets to fight to get across. Somebody cleared the way. In this area, which you can get to from the Searing Mesa, has some amber giving places. Unfortunately, in the gorgeous meander, there is no amber things for the water loving animals. So they won't be able to collect amber there. Now we're going to tear across the Searing Mesa and go to the sandbar. The sandbar has lots of big, bad, ugly filies. And you could work with another person to go through. But we're looking for amber, so we're just going to race through as fast as we can, grab the amber, and get to fish a tish Island. Now that we're on Fishatish Island, all the amber spots have been looked at. So we're going to head to the Forest Side Beach. Uh, if you don't forget your way, let's play. So he took a little detour there. So we'll go to the Forest Side Beach. He's more than willing to take some of these pollution blocks that match each other to get some bonus points. He's getting pretty close to 14. But if we go up, and this time we get to go to the left, which is a switch. And there's Sabina. But since we have limited time to do the video in, we don't have time to stop and chat. Sorry, Sabina. Here is the Inlet Isle. Alright, it's our first time here, so we'll pull up the map. And it looks like the goal station is either up and around or down and around. So we'll take the high road. And there's definitely pollution here that we need to clear out of the way because it won't let us through. But we're not overly concerned about clearing everything. We just want to get through so we can see what this goal is. Oh, a little snack. You might need that. Oops, we did that one by accident, didn't we, Let's Play? That wasn't a double pollution. Oh, look, and as he stretched out his legs, we find the goal station, and it says, Voucher Exchange. Turn in an amber voucher, and we will get 1,500 points. It's the prospector. Star friend, ah, I need some amber. The why ain't important, and you can probably guess who's for. I set up a stump over yonder to collect the amber and provide an amber voucher in return. I got a few lux and a special seven place blockomatic collection hooked up just for you. Alright, let's click the stump. 
Oh, it says we have 30 amber in our inventory and we can make the voucher. So we'll click OK. Oh look, Wooly Socks is down there. She's turning in some amber for a voucher too. Under miscellaneous now we'll see our amber voucher. And we can drop that on the goal station. One block coming up. Remember, there's seven in all. So we're going to need to get seven blocks to complete this world block puzzle. And it's a crab. So we got the block six out of seven. And it's going to take a lot of amber to get that because it's random and you never know which one will come up. So thanks for joining us on Let's Play Faunasphere. And now, an important message from Gypsy Woman 2. I'm going to be gone during October. I'll be out refreshing my mind and thinking up new ideas for our Let's Play videos. Tomorrow we will be posting a guest video from Gypsy Woman, Gold Collar Cruise of 2010. And this will be a good month to catch up on all the videos that we have up on YouTube right now, just in case you missed any. We have done all the goals except the Waddler Breeding Challenge that are available to date, and that is in our goal list for when it happens. I predict there will be updates in the game. Will it include this? Or a spooky Halloween. Bwah! Take note, every item in this picture was purchased with Lux that was earned doing Viley fighting or goals. There was no trading or asking or begging or gifting involved. This is not like the usual Facebook type game where you just ask for stuff and get it. Work hard for the things you want. Please don't beg or bother other caretakers. Not everyone feels like chatting. They may be working on their own goals. Look for friends that like to play the game the same way you do. Some like to chat. Some like to party. I've even been to a hatching party. Some like to fight violies with someone. Just have fun. And remember, I'll be watching you.